Now, people that know me, people that understand me, people that have taken baths with me are aware that I love my driving games. I love my Gran Turismo, my Motor Storm, my Mario Kart. So it's a wonder that I haven't been able to get into the Forza series as yet. But when I saw Forza Horizon on the shelf, I knew I just couldn't walk away. Especially when it said, better with Kinect sensor. I really just thought that was a blatant lie. So I picked it up and here's what I thought. The Forza series has made quite an impression on the Xbox 360 and it's established itself as one of its premier exclusives. So with this latest iteration of the franchise, developers Turn 10 and Playground Games have chosen to do something a little different with Forza Horizon. From afar it looks like Forza Spring Break Edition, but as a big fan of racing titles I was more than keen to see how this fared. Let's check it out. Forza's new summer approach is a welcome to Horizon. From the get-go you'll see a summery open skies, beautiful landscapes and miles and miles of road. But the real focus is on the driving, of which there's plenty to do. The concept revolves around a driving festival in which racers will compete in a variety of different challenges to be festival champion. The more you win, the better wristband you'll get to and in order to obtain these you'll need to race against a handful of colourful boss characters. It's a racing title with realistic driving and a whole lot of personality and colour. Now there's many tricks and manoeuvres that will increase your popularity on the road which also will give you more credit and also access to nuanced races. It's a game that is so slick and full of freedom it's hard to put down as it's consistently rewarding. The map itself is huge with tons of tracks, upgrades and of course cars to use. It's hard to see anyone having a problem with it. This is seriously top of the line presentation. Let me just run a couple of images across your brain. Sun shining bonnets, Nebraska sunsets, smoking tires and girls with belly button rings are just a few of the sights that will make this racer seem undeniably beautiful. And that's just during the day. The game operates day to night and during through you'll come through some great in-game lighting visuals that will only further please you. Everything about this game screams of beauty. The colours, the sunlight, the ranges from mountain forests to dirty canyons. Oh, I should change my pants. If anything, I would have liked more weather effects like rain and fog, but that's just a very small gripe. But what's better is the soundtrack. It has to be the best compilation of songs I've ever heard. From Porter Robertson to the Black Keys, New Order, The Highs, it really captures that festival mood for the game. Top it off with, with informative and fun commentary from the game's characters and chatter. Oh, and I forgot to mention that cars take realistic damage. Oh my lord! It's great. Now I know the game looks pretty and it sounds awesome and it gives you a lot of options but did they lose focus on the racing? The answer? No. The realistic driving mechanics are alive and well in this Forza and that's what makes this racer's gameplay so addictive. You'll need to familiarise yourself with each new track and choose the right car in order to get pole position. Whilst this may sound frustrating for casual gamers, it's actually incredibly rewarding and fun. Races differ from checkpoints to laps against online ghosts or even against helicopters and planes if you're trying to increase your popularity through showcase events. But like I mentioned before, this is an open world racer so feel free just to cruise around and see the sights. There's dozens of collectibles, secret cars, speed gauges and opponents to find, or drop by the festival central and upgrade, purchase or even customise your ride, there is so much to do. By unlocking Outpost you'll be able to fast travel with ease and also unlock promo events if you've got the time. But last but not least, online functionality is great and always present with daily challenges, leaderboards and raises. Forza Horizon is a driver's dream. Now when I picked up Forza Horizon, I literally couldn't put it down. I mean, I passed everything in this game. I got first place in every race, got every collectible. I went through every aspect of this game till there was no more. It's only recently when I picked it up again, I just realized that this is arguably the best racer of its generation. I mean, it's beautiful. It's got this youthy vibe to it. It's highly rewarding. 
I can't help it, I'm going to have to give it a 9.76 out of 10.01. Oh, if you like racing, this is, this is the ticket.